Hello, what's up guys? So in this video, I'm going to show you that how you can create an inline subscription form using Fluent Forms. We are using the light version or the free version of the Fluent Form. If you want to learn that how you can create an inline subscription form or newsletter form using Fluent Forms, let's get started. So the first thing that you will have to do is to click on this add a new form button here and then you can click on this blank form. This editor will load in from here click on this container option and from this container option you can choose the number of column you want. In this specific example because we are going to create a newsletter subscription form we will be using three column container. So click on that three column container and here you will have the three columns here. Now you have multiple ways to choose between the fields that you want here. Either you can click on this general fields and once we will choose this for example name field, drag it like here. I remove this and from here if I click on this field, I only want to choose the first name field and I will label it as only the name field. For this example I don't want to display the label so I'll hide the labels and for this field I want to insert the email field and again I will hide the labels from here and here in the placeholder I want to keep the email address and here in the advanced field you can see here we have custom submit button just drag this in the third column and here you can see our button is gone and now we have this button here let's click on this and then what I want to do is to click on this save form and if we click on preview you can see we have our inline form displaying here okay now what I want is to uh, go back to all forms and from here I first of all I want to rename this to the email subscription form I'll rename this one and then I'll go to my pages I have this contact page I have created with Elementor I'll click on edit with Elementor here and then I want to place that form right here so I'll search for fluent forms widget and I'll drag that widget here and then from here I can choose the form which is email subscription form now you can see here we have our form in this trial tab we can adjust the form styling here so here we have the label option and then input and text area field here input height that is what I want to increase so probably like 60 pixels here and then for the submit button I want to increase the padding so probably like 30 pixels uh, 20 pixels on the top and 20 pixels on the bottom I want to change the color for the button I also want to change the color for the hover button as well just like this now for the border type I don't want any border and then we have these fields here in this in placeholder field we can change the text color sounds like this input and text field we can change the border radius so for example we want to change it to 30 pixels and now we have 30 pixels here and in the submit button field I want to apply the same border radius and now you can see this is how you can create an inline email subscription form using WP Fluent Forms.